Yo, yo, what's up with the Raider Nation? It's your king here, Melvin Ward, and I usually do not do any Raider news, but this one definitely uh, is something huge for me because literally just now, I just found out that Raiders just waived two 2021 first round draft pick Alex Leatherwood, and it just shows that um, Alex Leatherwood was definitely a reach in uh, last year's draft and that uh, the new regime... Uh, the uh, the McDaniel's um, Ziggler regime is clean out clean out shop and it doesn't matter who is a part of the nation and if you're not getting the job done then you're not getting the job done and this news comes from Adam Schefter and he says Raiders uh, way former first round pick Alex Otherwood per source and uh, it says that the Las Vegas Raiders are already moving on from one of their top picks of last year's draft Alex Otherwood uh, was waived Tuesday Per source in the ninth in the 17th overall pick in the 2021 draft, Lutherford was only started 17 games. 17 games, and despite being part of a dominant offensive line in the national championship, he just didn't get the job done. He didn't get the job done. And as you can see during this year's preseason, he wasn't really doing much. And the fact that they had to keep moving him from from uh, from right guard to, to right tackle, trying to figure out things, uh, but it's it wasn't the move. It, 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 it wasn't the move at all. Uh, you know, uh, and I guess the people that we do have, I know Brandon Parker, he's hurt. Uh, I know uh, a humanor, I think that's his name. He's, uh, you know, he's a great player. We got Colton Miller, Miller on the other side. We got uh, Simpson on the other side as well. Uh, so we got some good linemen. It's just that, you know, even when I saw the pick last year, it was definitely a reach. I was like, ah. An offensive lineman first round, I mean, yeah, he wasn't, he, he, he yeah, last year, he wasn't the move. He, he did his best. And you know what? I just want to say, Alex Leatherwood, brother, if you're watching this, you're probably not going to be watching this, but hey, good luck to you and your other endeavors. It's just that you wasn't the right fit with the Raider Nation, uh, but I appreciate your services. Uh, last year and even in this preseason so I just wanted to give you guys that quick little news and <laughs> I don't do Raider news I've never done Raider news before but uh, I definitely wanted to do that so go ahead and subscribe to the YouTube channel like this video leave comments down below man it's your King or Melvin Ward signing off and I'm out I gotta zoom out for this I got look I literally just finished doing another like another video like I said, I don't do Raider news, but when it comes to Raider Nation, I follow the Raiders because as you can see, I'm part of the Raider Nation. But look, Adam, Ian Rappaport just reported that the Raiders are trading second round draft pick Trayvon Mullen to the Arizona Cardinals. The not sure exactly what he's being what we're what we're trading for him for, but this is huge. This is huge news. Like the McDaniels and Ziggler regime is not playing any games. Like if you, the best ability is availability. And if you're not available to play, you know what I'm saying? It's, he's cleaning up shop and no one is safe. And I got a feeling that uh, some some other people from the Gruden uh, regime is, is, is leaving, uh, i.e. Uh, Cleveland Farrell. You know what I'm saying? Like, I mean, if you're a bust, you're a bust. If you're not performing, but the thing is, what makes me it's it's interesting because Trayvon Mullen, when he's on the field, he can ball. Like when Trayvon Mullen is on the field, he can definitely perform and he can do his thing. It's just that, like, unfortunately, he's been getting hurt. He's been getting hurt. He's 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 been getting you know injured, so he's not available to play. But when he's on, he's on. So I'm kind of shocked and surprised. And I think you know with the people. But with the cornerbacks that we do have, uh, like uh, Rock Yassin, we have him, and I know we have the dude from um, what's his name? Uh, we just we didn't just get him, but he's you know he's been playing. Uh, he played for the Ravens, uh, not not on that, but you know y'all y'all know who I'm talking about. But yeah, man, like this is crazy I literally just put out a video well not just yet but I'm probably gonna combine those two into one thing but this is just crazy like the Raider like the Raiders like they're making cuts they're they're, they're getting it to the 53 man roster and I know I am not done with 
giving you guys some Raider news. And like I said, I've never done Raider news. I just had to do it today because I'm very shocked and surprised. And I, and I should have did it when we signed uh, Devontae Adams, but I mean, everybody did, did that already. But I'm just saying, yeah, we just waved Leatherwood and we just traded Trayvon Muller and I need to see, and I would love to see uh, what we got for him. I need to see what we got for him. Like, so what, like, who do we, who do we get? I, I really, I really want to know who we got for him. Um, yeah, I, I definitely need to see who, who we got from him because this is, this is, this is huge news. This is definitely huge news. Um, yeah, this is definitely huge news. Uh, yeah, not really sure exactly what it is, but I'll definitely keep you guys posted on uh, <laughs> on what's on what's going on with the Raider Nation. So uh, it's your King King here, Melvin Ward. Go ahead and subscribe to this YouTube channel, like this video, share this really comments down below what you guys think. If you guys follow football, if you guys follow the Raiders, man, let me know what you guys think. And uh, yeah, it's your King King here, Melvin Ward, signing off, and I'm.